Hello everyone, my name is Tyler Roberson. I'm here today at Smallwood Dam. It's in northern Gladwin County, Michigan. It is one dam in a chain of four along the Tittawassee River system. Construction for the dam started in 1922 and was finished in 1925. Its main purpose was for hydroelectric power and flood control. In about 30 miles, the river system empties into Lake Huron. I chose to study this area because of the age of the dams, since they are almost 100 years old, their impact on wildlife should be very prevalent. And it's also where I fish and where I spend a lot of time. The main species that have been impacted by this chain of dams are our native trout species. The steelhead, the brook trout, the rainbow, and the German brown trout. Above the four dams, it's considered to be a blue ribbon trout fishery, which means it's one of the best in the country. Below the dams, they're almost non-existent. Rainbow, the brook, the brown, and the steelhead used to rule the river systems. Now due to the warming of the water and the lower oxygen contents, their place has been taken up by the warm water species of fish, the largemouth bass, the smallmouth bass, the bluegill, the sunfish, and the northern pike. In talking with the DNR, the Department of Natural Resources for Michigan, and the owners of the dam, Lakes Hydroelectric, I've learned a lot. Most importantly, since 1980, the river system is constantly monitored 24-7, 365 for both temperature and oxygen content. The dams are constantly adjusted to maintain both the optimal for fish species. Also during the entire month of March, all dams are left open to allow fish to spawn unabatedly. In addition, two of the dams are left open at all times because their section of the river system is considered to be the most fragile. This topic is extremely important as green energy sources become more and more popular. And we must address the hidden costs upon our wildlife for our consumption of these green energy sources. Thank you very much and I hope you guys have a great weekend and thank you for watching my video.